have a tradition of every October doing some sort of fundraiser to donate to the Cancer Institute of Guyana. So this year we changed it up a little bit. We didn't sell t-shirts, we did a lemonade sale. Um, this month is personal to me because I have family members who have suffered with breast cancer. It's worrisome. Um, my aunts, I've had aunts that, that are dealing with breast cancer, but it's also worrisome to know that it runs in your family and it's, it's that, that anxiousness of, it could be me. You know, so it's not just about um, my worry, it's knowing that other people experience that also. The message I'd like to send is to know um, that people are praying for you, we're sending well wishes, we're asking that you stay hopeful, um, just keep fighting for us. I honestly don't think that we do enough. Um, I'm a strong, strong believer in social responsibility. I'm a strong believer in if you're blessed, you're supposed to pass your blessings along, you're supposed to help those who are less fortunate. Um, so honestly, I don't think that we're even scratching the surface. I think there's more for us to do. So the objective behind today's fundraiser is to raise funds to actually redo the Cancer Institute's waiting area. Um, patients go in there, they're already going through chemo and radiation. We just want to play, make the place a little bit more uplifting as much as we can do so. We already asked an interior designer if she would come on board and volunteer her service and she agreed. So we just want to be able to raise enough to complete redo the entire thing. We had a lot of people that came through and donated. Travelers, Sound System donated, the same table and chairs we're sitting at, um, Desinco donated, Enet donated, um, and so many other people that represent so many businesses I can't even recall at the moment. So Glow Aesthetics is a community um, and a business community that we're so lucky to have. Mm -hmm.